All right, welcome back into the Golden Tea Lounge for another Throwback Thursday tip. This week's hole, none other than Palm Springs. He says it right there, hole 17. There's my dude looking actually pretty average. We got to change your outfit, uh, but let's let's go up at the hole so you can see this massively 44 yard hole. Yes, 44 yards, and yet this hole over the years has tortured many of us because of the way it's mapped out. I, sorry get a little crazy with the satellite cam. Uh, it's easy to see why this hole can be difficult. You have the 11 slope green that is sloping downward, and then of course you have these water pits right here uh, that we've deposited many balls over the years. Now, as I say a lot of times, um, is I'll get a low T rate, that's what I'm gonna hit. Um, this is a hole that par in some setups is, is a good score. When you have a 17 mile an hour wind in your face, we don't have that here. This is not a terrible look, it's not a great look. Par is going to be okay. You can dump it into that bunker in the back, uh, chip it on, and hopefully make your putt. That's fine. Um, but you'll have some instances with an outwind where you can just kind of thumb it comfortably, roll it up next to the hole, and that'll be that. With this particular look, it's kind of in between. Uh, I know that I, for some reason I don't have a uh, the club selection here. The guy who built this bag, me, is an idiot. So I have an 80-yard club. I have a 40-yard club. Clearly, I'm not going to use the 40-yard club. That won't get there. What I'm going to do instead is I'm going to turn to the left one. I'm going to pull back just left of B to kind of get it cutting in a little bit. And I'm going to push it out here between one and two to cut off some distance. Not only will the low T help me eliminate some distance, but pushing it out between one and two will do that as well. Again, I'm not going to, I'm not going to hit this hard. I still want to finesse this in. If I can get my angle right, I feel good about that. And I'm going to push it out kind of like that and hope it lands. Now, in the next part of this, usually we hit that shot, it's an okay shot, is the, the putting. Um, this is downhill, there's some water behind it, hello cup. Uh, the one thing you're gonna try to avoid to do on this is hit a rollover or miss it entirely. My advice on these downhill putts, and this is another fun tip, is you're gonna pull it back towards C. This will eliminate this, uh, help you eliminate some speed on your putt. And the big tip and uh, advice I can give you on these shots is uh, you don't want to crush it, but you also doesn't, don't want to change your putting motion. When you try to adjust and compensate for the speed, things can go poorly and you'll end up missing the hole. So I'm going to pull back to C. I'm going to use my really bad thumb putting. I'm going to push it forward and I'm going to make it for a 66 under, I skipped a lot of holes. So that is it, hole 17 on Palm Springs, a good one. We'll see what the setup holds this week. Uh, maybe it'll be good, maybe not. Either way, now you have some tools to go at it. We will see you next week.